talking about the mall collection nagraj i'm building uh, nirmala toilets everywhere and i'm doing a uh, steel flyover also because i wanting money not talking about the humble politician okay uh, definitely not the, about the humble politician ask me the question again yen yen ye pon nilave pon nilave yen karave mere mile pul sugam dararatta i cannot make right todarade dinam dinam dararatta thank you Ooh, i just clap for myself and yeah, i slow thank you <laughs> marvelous you show that bit marvelous. to benny dal and you tell me he doesn't recognize my voice okay we're going to get serious now we're going to put on serious faces okay but like seriously speaking This is the final episode of On a Tank of Fuel and we begin this end at an automobile showroom on the outskirts of Bangalore. We meet some unique people who have done unique things on many tanks of fuel. And so we begin this end with Bhairav, a lawyer by profession along with Sunaina, a political researcher, Binoy, an automobile entrepreneur, and I went to Christ University together. But That isn't the reason for them being here today. Bhairav Binoy and Sunaina drove a Tata Nano across 13 countries that spanned over two continents, covering over 18,200 kilometers to raise funds for kids in shelters here in India. They did this as a part of the Mongol Rally in 2016 and were the first team from India to compete in the rally in an Indian-made car. This epic journey changed their lives in more ways than one. driving through the UK, France, Spain, Switzerland, Italy, Austria, Germany, Czech Republic, Poland, Lithuania, Latvia, Russia and finally ending up in Mongolia. They showed the world that three Indians with a car made right here in India could do something phenomenal. The next guest that I had the pleasure of meeting was Anil Giriraj, the co-founder of Wicked Ride. and he joined us on this episode to talk about what it was like for an entrepreneur with a bike startup here in India. Wicked Ride is a startup right out of Namma Bengaluru that deals with renting out bikes across 10 cities in India. They are your go-to people if you want to rent a superbike, a regular motorcycle, a scooter, cycles and even electric bikes. They are also a brand trying to solve issues related to last mile connectivity in metros and tier 2 cities. They have a massive fleet of Harleys, Kawasaki's, Triumphs, Ducatis, Benelli's, KTM's all the way to your Suzuki's, Hondas and Enfields. And with a presence in Bangalore, Jaipur, Udaipur, Mysore, Bhuj, Ahmedabad, Belagavi, Jaisalmer, Gokarna and Manipal. These guys are here to stay and are here to make a mark. Up next is Shreya Sundarayar. She's a freelance architect and an interior designer by profession. But more importantly, she is a musician and the first woman to ride 40 ways racing on their racing team back in 2016. Shreya wears many shoes and is constantly juggling between different professions. She's also passionate about animal welfare and promises to make a positive impact with the way we look at and treat animals. A multiple podium winner, a classically trained musician and dancer, Shreya loves to travel and believes in experiencing and living life to its fullest. Last but not the least, you might be wondering about the blurred face at the back of the car. Funny story, his company shut down and due to many reasons, including the fact that the company still owes me money. We decided to leave him out of the final episode. It's funny because even after 13 years of doing this professionally, I still haven't learned how to take an advance before I begin my work. But that's my problem. Since the conversations on this last episode were intense and also quite lengthy, we decided to put them up as a podcast on SoundCloud. I've left the link in my description. and also make sure you remain subscribed to my youtube channel for a lot more 
This is me, Vineet Vincent, signing off and asking you to stay tuned for Behind the Scenes of On a Tank of Fuel Series 1.